getting the chimney ready. Not on your side has teamed up with the Tucson Fire Department to bring you some safety tips. Tonight, Captain Barrett Baker has your chim chimney advice. Tucson, the old Pueblo, Tea Town, where we have summer and winter and very little in between. But as we enter the in between, it's time that we talk a little bit about the flus. They're not the one you're thinking of, rather chimney flues. With the temperatures dropping at night, it might be time to light up the old fireplace. But here's a little factoid that's not so much fun. Fireplaces and chimneys are responsible for almost half of all home heating fires. So let's go over a few things beforehand to make sure that the fire stays where it's supposed to, in the fireplace. First, clean the flue before using the fireplace. Soot and other debris can remain from previous usage and ignite, causing a chimney fire. Now you can go Mary Poppins and do it yourself, or you can hire someone, and that's no song and dance. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chimaroo. Second, not being familiar with this step will put a real damper on the evening. Always open the damper before lighting the fire. This will avert the buildup of poisonous gases such as carbon monoxide by letting the smoke escape. Third, now we call it a fireplace, not a barn fireplace. Simply put, do not overload it. Large fires can lead to overheating of wall or roof materials, particularly if the fireplace is constructed of metal. Lastly, allow ashes to cool before disposing of them. Place the ashes in a tightly covered metal container and keep the ash container at least 10 feet away from your home or any other nearby buildings. And there we have it, some tips to get us through the winter season. And remember, a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down, but a chimney fire would be a bitter pill to swallow. It's the little things. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chimaroo. Do, 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 do. I think the captain likes costumes. Yeah, I think he does too. He had a little something on his <laughs> cheek. Somebody should have really told him about that. Good He's advice so from Captain Barrett Baker. All right, stick around. We have one last look at your evening forecast when we come back.